All right, welcome to my browser. Uh, this is going to be two very short um, well, factoids for you guys. I uh, just want to put it out there. Uh, this is a coming from a quote-unquote bitter vet, so you can totally ignore what I say. So their recent uh, article about what's happening in EVE, uh, and it generated a little bit of excitement uh, when I read it, when it said, <clears throat> following the release of Uprising, faction warfare has heated up with over 5,300 new pilots enrolling in faction militia groups to participate. And I was like, wow. That's really cool. It's getting people interested in faction warfare. Oh my god, that's more than bef I just assumed that uh, when they said new pilots, it generated the thought of more than what was from the old faction warfare community, right? That's the sense I got. Um, you could also read it as there are 5,300 new players or new characters being generated that are going into faction militia groups or whatever you can but the reality is what they most likely did was say oh new pilots <clears throat> as they've obviously never done this before uh the alliance test alliance uh yeah, that uh, helped us push this metric above board, and yay. Also, the recruitment evolved. Bit of a spoiler. I'll uh, show you something interesting. So, I recently looked at, um, you know, the online status, and I went, oh, it jumped. And I was like, wait a minute. Was that jump because of the recruitment thing yeah I think so I freaking think so like I totally freaking think so now I could be wrong that is a lot of new players they could be all coming back to the game or, I'm sorry, a lot of returning players uh, or people interested in this stuff coming back to the game uh, for Faction Warfare. And it was on the 12th, so it wasn't the 19th. So I could be totally wrong. Um... And when did I, when did I, when did I talk about recruiting? The 20th, okay. All right. So I don't want to jump to conclusion because we didn't know before they released it, the recruiting stuff. So I think it's highly possible that people could just be coming back to the game um, and they could be trying it out. It's just, yeah, just, uh, you know. Yeah, let's just assume I'm wrong. Oh, uh, so correction. Um, this is like this. The peak was the twelfth, right? And one is assuming the faction warfare thing is what dragged people into the game. Um, <laughs> Beyond Uprising, save multiple, nine, save. Uh, okay, 
patch notes. Assuming this is going to say KV8. Okay. Okay, October 24th. Let's uh, mirror this down here. There we go. Alright, so October 78th. Okay, so it was. Okay, so Uprising can totally drag old players back and probably interested new players and stuff like that. So it's doesn't it doesn't look like there there's anything to do with this. They might have kickstarted this into um, you know they probably had it in the pipeline and were like hey let's do it now. I don't think it was a deliberate thing. Uh, I don't think that they had a plan, but yeah, uh, this is definitely uh, I don't know. I don't I don't think it's sincere um, it's, uh, where is it? Der. right this could easily be the alliances joining easily I I could be wrong I could be wrong but I'm not overly enthused about the participation um i just suspect that it's you know i don't really believe it's a thing let's um what's the highest uh top corporation top alliances top ships top systems so where's that 0.4 placid what the hell is placid Uh, faction warfare, right? So there's Dark Rise and I guess Placid too. Yeah, Black Rise. Okay. So the connection between. Okay, so Empire Gate maybe. All right, Region Gate. Sorry. Um, Orville, close to Orville. Uh. So let's check. Last 48. Can I get better statistics? Hmm. Okay. Jumps, NPC kills, ship kills, pod kills, action warfare, contested level. That's ours, so uh, start. Let's try November 1st. Update. Oh. Well, bloody hell. Okay, there we go. Okay, so NPC kill, ship kills. Oh shit, what? Oh, okay, good. That's twenty-eight. Good. Okay, these are the days. Good, 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 good. good. Day. Month. Okay. So on the eighth, was there an uptick? Kind of was actually. Kills, pod kills. Yeah, so definitely an increase. All right. And wow. Okay. Well, the contestant letter might not mean anything uh, because they change it so much. Maybe. But it, it it's definitely showing. Um, 
Yeah, interesting. So there's obviously a lot more activity. I, I'm just not paying attention, right? Interesting. Yeah, so, yeah, I, I could be wrong. This could actually be genuine and not just, oh, Test Alliance entered the Faction Warfare. At least Test Alliance entered and, oh, look, you know. So, we'll go to Ifu. We'll check out... Okay, members, uh, largest alliance is Pandemic Horde. They are not part of Faction Warfare. Not part of Faction Warfare. Oh, wait, what? Oh, shit. Whoops. Uh, <laughs> Don't expect them to be. Let's check fraternity. Okay. But it, I'm starting to suspect that it, it truly was just marketing, shoehorning in uh, the members of Test Alliance to pump up their numbers uh, so they can make that kind of announcement of, you know, it, it, it is exciting when you see that kind of numbers, but at the same time, it's like, oh, you know, um, so it's starting to track. <laughs> it's definitely starting to track if you minus that so that okay 1500 new players had joined faction warfare um but what if we find an alliance of 1500 right you know and then you're like oh okay so this there's no real new entrance of any note it's just a couple alliances have joined faction warfare because they can right Okay. Boo. I suppose I could. Oh, never mind. Do you get the general idea? Um, so Test Alliance isn't one of the biggest ones. Um, what do they hold? Do they hold any sovereignty? I'm assuming they do. Re oh.
Okay, so they lost sovereignty in October. Okay. All right, fair enough. Well, there's your answer. They're like, hey, we got nothing going on, let's join. And for a month, they've been fallow, and they're like, hey, let's join Faction Warfare. So, yeah, okay. It's kind of neat. Uh, I think there's our answer right there. Interesting stuff. Um, hmm. Anyways, uh, hopefully that, that was informative and people were curious about faction warfare and then the blurp in numbers so yeah probably uh, older players returning to check out uh, the new stuff in uprising